This is a short overview of the XR75 X-Ray System's new product, Setup Wizard. The process usually takes about five minutes. To demonstrate, we'll use this pouch of instant mashed potatoes. From the main menu, just click Register New Product to launch the wizard. These are the wizard's steps. Typically, you'll just use the defaults seen here. First, we need to name the product. We'll call it Instant Potato 4 Ounce. For conveyor settings, this is packaged product, not bulk, running at 30 meters per minute. In this case, we'll leave product recognition in automatic mode. On the inspection options screen, we'll just inspect for contaminants. But you can also check product weight, counts, and integrity, and even enable masking to prevent packaging elements from being interpreted as contaminants. The XR75 comes with special detection algorithms that cover the majority of applications. We'll skip number one, which is a legacy algorithm. Number two is for smooth products with soft edges, like powders and pouches. Notice how the example X-ray images reflect this product type. Algorithm three is optimized for smooth products with more defined edges, like a brick of cheese. The fourth algorithm works best with products with uneven shapes, uh, composed of smaller granular pieces like trail mix or cereal. Algorithm five is ideal for products with uneven shapes and larger overlapping pieces, such as bagged chicken nuggets or candies. We'll select algorithm two, smooth products with soft edges for our pouch of instant mashed potatoes. The software allows expert operators to manually set X-ray voltage and current. For most, we recommend the auto setting, which almost always delivers excellent results. Next, the wizard prepares for a single master product pass-through to calibrate sensitivity and power. The wizard analyzes the X-ray data and then advances to the next step. Here you can see the appropriate X-ray output settings for best sensitivity with this product. Now the wizard prepares to calibrate its 10 software tools. To further refine the settings, we'll pass the product through the machine 10 times. A great feature is that you can easily replace any of the passes. For example, pass 7 was skewed. We'll remove it and rerun the product. This screen shows the post-analysis settings of the XR75's 10 detection tools. Working as a team, each tool is tuned to find different contaminant properties. Here, you can tune your reject timing to properly transfer no good products off the main conveyor. The wizard summarizes its automatic settings on one screen. For this demo, we'll change the image display settings to always show the X-ray image for every product pass. Now let's run a clean product with no contaminants to verify the automatic settings and ensure that they don't reject good product. And it looks good. The next step is to run a contaminant test. We attached the test card with certified stainless steel spheres to the product. And you can see by the red markers that the machine detected all six metal spheres ranging from 0.6 to 1.5 millimeters. Now let's try rubber, which is much harder to detect than steel due to its lower density. Once again, the machine found all six contaminant spheres, this time ranging from three to eight millimeters. The XR75 makes creating new product settings simple and quick. In most cases, you can just follow the wizard prompts to create an effective product preset that will start working immediately. Thanks for watching this demonstration. For more information, visit us on the web at enritsu.com slash infivis.